back on deck. Ghost Rider 2, let's call it a day. You just did an incredibly brave thing. What you should have done was land your plane. You don't own that plane. The taxpayers do. Yes, sir. Cougar's out. He turned him in. He's the best, sir. Was. Two days from now, I was going to bring him with me to Miramar. <laughs> you know, I got to do something here. I still can't believe it. I'm going to give you your dream shot. We're going to Miramar up against the best. You two characters are going to Top Gun. Let's not kid around, Maverick. Your family name is not the best in the Navy. You need to do better and cleaner than the other guy. Now get packed. You and I are just getting started.
morning, morning, sir. You were all invited to Top Gun because your commanders thought you were the finest pilots in the Navy. Congratulations. Top Gun teaches one thing, air combat maneuvering, dogfighting. You all come with impressive records, notably Lieutenant Rachel Singer, Callside Raven. Her running point total is second highest in the fleet, so boys, watch your sixes. Actually, sir, it's the highest. Cougar retired. I stand corrected. Out of VF-56 Stinger, who brings outstanding marks in telemetry and air combat maneuvering, this here is a dogfighter. Mav, you want to know who's the best? That's him. You're all good. We'll make you better. We'll find your weaknesses and turn them into strengths, and when you leave here, you will be the best. Sir, how will we know who's the best of the best? Your score on each mission is added to your total score. The best of the best goes here, the Top Gun Trophy. Your first mission pits you against a single instructor. Scoring starts now. Lock and load, team. The fight is on. All right, not bad for a first mission. You're off to a good start. But let's not get cocky, we'll slow you down. This hop, you fly against jets that are smaller and faster, just like the enemy. All right, let's go. All right, now let's start again from the top. Welcome to Top Gun. Welcome to the major leagues. Now pick it up, Maverick. Igno's gonna get rusty.
You sure did use your head out there, Maverick. Good flying. Looked like luck to me. But we'll see next time, huh? From the EBS News Desk, Tom St. Germain and the World News. Good evening. Tonight's top story comes from the Russian Republic. Foreign correspondent Amanda Moore is in Moscow. Early this morning, the town of Lostikov received a rude awakening. Military jets streaking through the sky at 500 feet. MiG-21s, 23s, and 29s have been pouring out of the local air base, and no one knows why. According to the ranking officer, these departures were not authorized. The planes left the area at altitudes below radar range, making electronic detection impossible. More ominously, the identities of the pilots remain a mystery. Score! Double check those electricals! So is this airbase next? Oh my god, how did they get in here? No photos! Get out! Get out! While the State Department believes that the Russians are taking every precaution, the Pentagon's not taking chances. Right now, the situation here is uncertain, and we will keep you posted of any developments. From Moscow, this is Amanda Moore, EBS News. Think she likes flyboys? Stinger, blow it out your tailpipe. Those weapons were live, Maverick. You'd be dead at the break. Hey, Stinger, weren't you his wingman on that one? Today we're going to see what you're made of. You'll face a numerically superior enemy, and you must visually ID them before engaging. Before engaging. We'll see who blinks first. few months, the Cubans have endured a lack of basic foodstuffs, transportation, and even water. 
Uh, with the fall of the Soviet Union, Castro has suffered a steady decrease in popular support at home. The riots in Cuba today are another indication that Castro may be headed for a political crisis. Some of you are slow learners. Maverick, you gotta learn to use your head up there, son. Your butt, sorry as it is, was expensive to train. Thanks for the trophy, Mav. You're a real prince. We're going feet dry today. You'll fly inland to the tax range, where we drill on air-to-air -air combat skills. Mission is a mixed sweep in advance of a strike. You'll be engaged by an unknown number of bogeys. Keep them away from the target. Fortunes in exporting to Western Africa. Europe. wins one. Pretty soon the groupies will be buying you drinks. Another time, Lieutenant, we're a little behind. The media's got the scoop on us, so pay attention. Cuban troops are amassing along the periphery of the base. With more from Guantanamo Bay, Cuba, we now go to Amanda Moore. Today, the world watches in disbelief as Cuban troops prepare to take Guantanamo Bay by force. The president flew back from Camp David for an emergency meeting of the National Security Council. White House sources report that the U.S. is considering military intervention in the area. More as this crisis develops. Short list of candidates. The one who stood out was... You're like Mrs. a kid Meister that hates his paper route. Some, some days you show up, some days you don't. Europe, you can't Western deliver, Europe, Maverick. Maybe you should look for another line of work.
Well, what have we here? Mavericks out front? That's a nice trophy, Stinger. Unless you do something about it, you lose. This one's in the bag, sir. This is your final hop around on me when you're done. Go to your planes. Woo! Woo! Stinger, another solid performance. Maverick, son, do you want that trophy or not? No, he doesn't. But you sure look cool. You two would fight over a game of tiddlywinks. But when it's all over out there, we're all on the same team, right? Right! 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 right. All right. on deck. Please be seated and welcome to graduation. Now before we present the Top Gun Trophy, I'd like to congratulate everyone on a job extremely well done. The overall performance of this class is the very finest in the history of this school. Under normal circumstances, we'd introduce each flyer and maybe sing a song or two, but we've got a situation.
All 400 tomorrow, some of us are shipping out from Cuba. The base at Guantanamo Bay has come under attack. Sir, weren't they ready? Absolutely, but the Cubans got unexpected air support. That's, That's where we come in. So without further ado, the Top Gun Trophy goes to Maverick. Very good. Congratulations, you're now among the finest aviators in the Navy. But the games are over, the next ammo you see will be live. Attention on deck. Dismiss. We interrupt this broadcast with a special report. An unarmed U.S. surveillance plane has been shot down near Cuban airspace. Diplomatic channels remain closed as U.S. forces move into the region. All right, listen up, here's the situation. Cuban ground forces are moving on Guantanamo Bay. As for the plane, it was possibly shot down by the Cuban Air Force or someone else altogether, we're not sure. Mr. O'Donnell has the intel. We have a rapidly escalating situation here. Our naval base at Gitmo has come under fire. And there is the possibility of a democratic coup in Havana. Your concern is the Cuban Air Force. Veterans. But their planes are old monkey models. Their tactics, straight Soviet bloc. Radar has picked up some unidentified plane signatures in the area, so Rios, keep an eye out. Maverick, Raven, you're on Barcat patrol. Anything even looking at us is to be shot down unless confirmed friendly. This is the real thing. Good luck. an unmarked MiG, pulling a split S like that. Guy could have been a Westerner with no markings. Maybe he was from way west like Pluto. Come on, Merlin, everybody's got a split S. It was the way he did it. The way? Yeah! Maybe he's just good. Maybe he's just toying with you sorry clowns. Cubans are bringing mobile artillery to pound the base. No way. The F-18 squad is bringing heavy ordnance and we run support. Stay sharp. This one's behind enemy lines.
Maverick! Good work, Maverick. You fly with heart, just like your dad. Nice going, Mav. Merlin, what do you got? We were engaged again by unmarked planes. These unmarked guys Anybody are else good. see this? Nope. Nothing new to report. Sorry, Merlin. Look, we saw it. Them. They've been dogging me and Maverick. Maybe you should try switching the decaf. Save it for the enemy or I'll ground you both. Maverick, you do not need to take on everything in the sky. I hereby give you permission to come back alive. Got it? They're making a new run on Gitmo. You will seek and engage all Cuban fighters and bombers. If we fail this one, the president's ready to evacuate the base. And I don't want that on my tombstone. The way they cut, the way they move. It. These unmarked guys are good. They're definitely Western trained. Yeah, yeah, so was Custer. You know, I don't care what anyone says. You are definitely one bad dude. Hey, they ain't messing with the first team. Check six, Custer. Goes your wingman bugging out again. He's got survivors, including Amanda Moore. But we got MiG swarming all over our aircraft. You gotta get back up there. When they finish the check, you're off the cat in three seconds. Go!
You guys should have heard the captain. Fifty times he must have said, Hold! Ooh. Don't fire until fired upon, son. I'm sorry, guys. Got a little close to the action. Thanks for saving our lives. The pleasure was all mine. Uh, ours. But uh, to tell you the truth, uh, we're not exactly excited about having you on board. <laughs> right, Matt? Matt. Maverick? Duke Mitchell's son? I know something about you, so you better watch yourself. What, are you wearing new cologne or something? Man, whatever it is, give me some. And these are Mav's photos. Lots of Cuban MiGs. There, Mav. Unmarked MiG 29s. I guess we owe you guys an apology. MiGs and bears parked in revetments here, here, and here. AAA, here, here, and SAM sites. We got orders to take it to them. Anything not ours between here and there, you drop it. Splash anything that's not ours. We were flying bar cap at Angel 25, right? Nothing's happening for the longest time. Maverick, I've got to talk to you. I've got news. Good news? There may be mercenaries working here, opening up holes for the Cubans, MIGs for hire. You were right. Are you sure about this? I've got a source down here. He said the plane simply showed up one day. Flight quarters, flight quarters, all hands, man your flight quarters. There you are. We've got orders to support a counterattack. We gotta knock out the air defense. Maverick, you'll escort F-18s on a strike.
In a thrilling dogfight over Havana today, F-14 Tomcats destroyed the last of the Cuban threat to Guantanamo Bay. At the moment of truth, the mysterious squad of MiG-29s that had supported Cuban ground forces simply abandoned the area. Their whereabouts are unknown at this time. In sports news, a rookie rookie has won the prestige. Congratulations, team. The sky is clear of threats, and Castro has learned a lesson. I'm putting you all in for air <laughs> But do not get comfortable. We got a situation brewing in Korea. North Korean tanks are massing along the border. We've been ordered to catch up with the USS Kitty Hawk steaming for the South China Sea. Pack extra rations, it's going to be a long flight. This is an instant update from EBS News. North Korean forces have indeed crossed the demilitarized zone into South Korea. We now go to Amanda Moore in Seoul. Before American forces could solidify the border, North Koreans poured into South Korea. Why? The Defense Department is looking for an answer. Stay tuned for updates. Well, I see we made it. Welcome aboard. The Kitty Hawk is steaming north at flank speed to get in on the action. Weapons are free. Splash anything that's not ours. Current operating orders. You're allowed to overfly North Korea. China is off limits. Suspicious bogeys may be staging from the mainland, but we have our orders. We now go to Amanda Moore in Seoul. There's been an attack on a U.S. warship off the coast of South Korea. Four Badger bombers accompanied by fighters attacked the USS Kitty Hawk. But these threats were driven off thanks to a few brave F-14 pilots.
Watch this. Unmark leagues again. Yes, sir. We caught one. I have radar contact on two fast-moving aircraft. Bearing 164 at 15 kilometers. Radio discipline isn't Soviet, and they don't sound Chinese. Who are these guys? We have intel on a bunch of mercenary pilots. Renegade aces, they call themselves the cadre. Everybody wants to be the first to engage these guys, but that does not change procedure. You are a team, no freelancing. Is that clear, Maverick? An unmarked MiG-29. These guys are back. The CIA ran a trace of this face, the leader of the cadre, a flying ace many times over. Call sign is Nomad. Nomad? Are you sure? I wish I wasn't. North Koreans are trying to flank our lines. You hit any MiGs over the ground action. Now get moving. North Koreans are driving south. 
While they're on the move, we hit the rare fields on escort to the strike package, and let's show them who owns the air. The North Koreans are stalled north of Seoul. Remember MacArthur's end run on Incheon? Well, we're gonna pull a reverse. We're being ordered northward into the Sea of Japan. As we cross the Korean Strait, you will lead a MiG sweep in advance of the ship. These are dangerous and restricted waters. Nothing gets through, nothing gets near, that is all. Well, gentlemen, I see you made it. There was some outstanding aviating. You two should be Swiss cheese. <laughs> Thanks, sir. Not my style, Mav, but it was gutsy. Now you're veterans, and I'd be proud to go into battle with any one of you. Even you, Stinger. All right, so what's the story? Well, uh, we were following the flight path, and then Anytime you want to jump in, Mav. You guys let us down. All right, come on, let's move on. All right, we got a Marine landing near Wonsan, but the North Koreans are still launching. If they hit our guys on the beach, well, you know the drill. The cadre's been spotted in the area. These guys are all aces, with a lot of kills on pilots like you, Mav. Pilots who get emotional and make mistakes.
right, get back up there. Stinger's got a half full of bogeys. You're the only ones in range. Raven, your wing. Tricks on Stinger. I like that. I got your six. Maverick, that personal stuff between you and the cadre, forget about it. You're a professional now. Just do the job. Merlin, you watch for the wingman. That's the killer. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. guys looking at they're concerned about what those cadre pilots really seem to have it out for you maverick your ego's right in checks your body can't cash if you get somebody killed just don't come back all right your mission is to stop migs from threatening our troops you'll fly with the strike package and hit the mig staging from the yalu river area the migs may withdraw across the border what's there we don't know do not even if you've got the shot, do not take the bait. That's what got your father killed.
This morning, off the coast of Libya, a civilian airliner has been shot down. The U.S. has threatened a response. Let's go to Amanda Moore in Tripoli. Amanda. Tom, the Libyan government has decided the time is right to reassert its claim to a 12-mile exclusionary zone. In the center of the city, Colonel Gaddafi spoke out on his intentions, but did not answer questions about rumors of a pact with a mysterious squadron known as the Cadre. To protect its commercial traffic, the U.S. has sent a carrier group into the region. Up here. The fireworks have already started. We lost a Tomcat to one of the cadre. He was a good flyer, just like you. Intelligence sources are talking about the new MiG-29F, which packs six air-to-airs and a pile of other nasties. Defensively, it can hairball your radar ten different ways. They're in the area. Count on it. All right, let's go. This fax came for you. I have information for you, Amanda. I trust you'll share the goodies. Flight quarters, flight quarters, all hands, man your flight quarters stations. All right, Maverick, escorted by Stinger and Raven, you fly a low altitude recon over the coast. Yeah, I know. You want Nomad, but now's not the time. Your mission is recon. Recon! Sir, Nomad's picking him out even when they got easier targets in range. Raven Stinger, you worry about Nomad. Maverick, Merlin, you worry about Recon. You can count on us, sir, and nothing personal to Stinger, but wouldn't this do better as a two-plane team? The past is the past, Merlin. This is it. You two are covered, all right? Case closed.
I'm here with perhaps the most feared man to ever grab a flight stick, Nomad. His squadron of elite pilots has been spotted in Cuba, Korea, and now Libya. Nomad, why here? Why Libya? The colonel is an old family friend. Seriously? Seriously. He and my cousin used to hunt elephants together. You would start a war just to help an acquaintance of your cousin? We are well compensated. The colonel is a very generous man. How on earth do you justify that? What is the expression? Ah, yes. Have plain will travel. It can't be only money. No. No, no, no. There are other issues to settle. Such as? I can take anything I want when I want, and that is all you and the world need to know. This chat is over. I must prepare. All right, I'll listen up. Maverick, Stinger, Wolfman, Raven, you just volunteered for a high-priority mission. We've been ordered to try to flush out the cadre to pinpoint their base. You guys bait the trap. You trail your coats and generally make yourselves obnoxious. And when they come out of their hives, we sting them. Let's go. Now we hit the cities to keep down the Libyan army while you hunt the cadre. You will escort a group of F-18s to take out defenses around Tripoli. Look worried. Only because I've studied the target area. Yeah, so? You're worried about something else. What is it? It's you, Mav. You can't let this jerk get to you. You gotta be cool and fly with your head. All right, listen up. This is the most dangerous theater we've seen. They have every defensive weapon that exists. SA-8s, 9s, 12s. Okay, here it is. You will execute a long-range, low-level flight with the Fizan Desert to find and identify the cadre base. You will identify and plot, but avoid engaging any defensive systems. Let's go.
good, <laughs> but not that good. We're over the line, Ogre. We gotta get back. Negative, Spike 2. I've almost got luck. What's that? History. Old history. I'm closing. Closing. Two bogeys inbound. They're low, Ogre. They're low. I've almost got him. How'd you get it? From old KGB files. Most anything's for sale over there now. Maverick, it's your dad. Bogey, Angels 2-5. Where'd he come from? Oh, God. Clean him. Clean him. It's Duke's last mission. His wingman, he crossed the border against orders. Duke stayed with him right into the ambush. Your dad, he shot a MiG off his six, saved him. But the pilot who shot your dad... Cowboy, cowboy! Stupid move, cowboy! That's no man. Duke! Eject! Eject! Oh, God! You may go now, cowboy. It's not your fault, cowboy. Other cowboy, he crossed the line first, yes? Yes, I think so. Enter! What can I do for you? You can give us permission, sir. Mm -hmm. Permission for what? Permission to go hunting, sir. Gentlemen, I couldn't be happier with your performance in Top Gun, but there's nothing I can do. You're flying wing for Stinger. Stinger? But we've been flying... That's an order, Lieutenant. I will not have a bloodbath in this company because of this history. Maverick is one soldier to another. You would do the memory of your father far more good if you just do what you're told to do. Now get out there and bust some heads. Excellent work. The cadre defenses have been suppressed, and we're pegged to escort the strike on the base. That's right, we. Igno and I will be joining you today. I'll be leading Alpha Squad, Igno's lead on Bravo. It's going to be one tough run up there, and it's likely some of us may not return, so you may want to take a moment to write your loved ones, anybody you care for. I promise you this will be the hop of your life, and should it be the last... I had a talk with the CAG. Apparently he didn't know about Nomad and your dad. He said it went a long way toward explaining a lot of things. And we both agreed. You've got a fly point on this one. This is your chance. Let's take out Nomad. As a team. My radio went dead. Give me an update. A Hawkeye spotted Sukhoi 27s rising from the middle of nowhere, wearing exocets. Escort is a single MiG-29. Nomad. The guy's a lone wolf. He doesn't fly formation unless it's business. 
Sir, Maverick's on the cat. He's the only one with a shot. God better love a hard case. Are you rolling? Three, two, one. This is Amanda Moore on the USS Kennedy, which at this moment is the target of Libyan Sukhoi fighter bombers and possibly the cadre. Our first line of defense right now is a single Tomcat trying to intercept the Sukhoi before they can launch missiles. Come on home, gang. With the defeat of the cadre, Colonel Gaddafi was forced to reopen the sea. While Nomad was shot down, the body of the leader of the cadre has not been recovered. And for this team of Top Gun trained flyers... Maverick! I want his hide! It's time for a little R&R. They've certainly earned it. This is Amanda Moore, signing off. <laughs>